Uh, Barney Frank, Frank, the, uh, Barney Chan and the, 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 the gym chant. I have a question you, for you. <laughs> I have a question for you, Barney. Thank you so much for coming here. Um, you made a good point out there that I, I have definitely been feeling as I've been trying to get people registered to vote. Is that you're probably right in that a good amount of people here are not registered to vote or don't plan on voting. Why do you think that is? How do we'll we be on the couch doing bong hits instead of voting? It's a you know, <laughs> I know someone who did it last last election. People say, oh, nobody listens to us, so I don't vote. People say, oh, nobody listens to us. People don't appreciate this anymore. And they're ready to vote. 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 Thank you so much. Thank you so much. Thank you. Do you guys have a card? Like um, a business you know what? card? I just said we have that group without a card. We should have a card. We have a Facebook page, two hotheads, where I have a card. They're distorting it. That's why I said we should turn back. I'm just going to write something. A message to his office and they'll email me. We need a card. There were cultural biases involved. If we were to allow adults to make the choice to smoke marijuana if they wanted to, we would save a substantial amount of money on law enforcement, on prison, on the judicial system, and we would be able to gain some revenues. So there are very, very few issues which in my mind are as clear cut. I will also say this, we are making progress here. This is an issue where the public is ahead of the politicians, but you've got to do something about it. As I look around at this crowd, I'm very glad to see people here, but I have to tell you, there's one thing about the crowd that makes me a little critical. My bet is that most of you are not in the habit of voting regularly. And this isn't going to change until you do. I am. Everybody here... If everybody here votes this November and gets friends to vote, we will get this changed very quickly. Yeah! There are voter registration tables here. Yeah! Use them. Yeah! Get out there and take advantage of them. We are getting closer to the victory for freedom that we are looking for. And I talked about money. Money would be the benefit of recognizing freedom. It's not the reason for doing it. We're doing it because people in this society ought to be able to make those choices. So I appreciate what the organizations are doing. I'm continuing to work with them, but the change is going to come from the people here voting themselves. And when you go home next week, call up your state representative, call up your state senator, call up your member of the House and Senate and Congress and tell them you don't want to be treated as a criminal because you choose to make this personal decision. And if everybody does that, we're going to win. Thank you. Awesome. Ladies and gentlemen, give it up for Barney Frank. I want to behave like other politicians, so I want to introduce my husband, Jim, who's right here.